John, how are you, sir? JCVD. Thank you. Thank you. Here we are. Well, thanks for joining us. Uh, I'm a big fan, as you know. You know, it just occurred to me, I was talking to you earlier, and you referred to yourself with your initials, and you said, old Mr. VD here. Oh, Van Damme. Van Damme, all right. Yeah, yeah. Say no more. But I'm a big, big fan, and uh, normally I'd like to get in a six-pack of beer, maybe a curry, watch one of your movies, Bloodsport, Double Impact. I saw the new film today, Nowhere to Run, and here you are. It's a love movie. As well as action, there's a love story. You're looking after some kids, and I thought, Jean-Claude's gone soft on me. <laughs> no, I'm trying to do something, uh, not different, but uh, to to do a love story with action and comedy, it can be more big for the audience. So you're going for a bigger crowd with a sort of wider story. Yeah. Now it's written, I noticed, by Joe Esterhaus, who's the guy who wrote um, Basic Instinct. Esterhaus. Esterhaus, okay. okay. I do apologize. Esterhaus, <laughs> he wrote Basic Instinct. Right. And in that you have Michael Douglas unforgettably bearing his buttocks to the world. In this movie, he's written a part for you in which you show, I believe, your derriere. Yes. Now, Number one, is it crucial that he has this in every film? And number two, was this yours or was a stunt bottom employed? <laughs> it was. <laughs> Fine. Uh... I'm glad it was. <laughs> it was, it was, uh, it was my uh, butt. Yeah. And uh, <laughs> the story wants so. I mean, in the story, uh, Sam, the character, wants to show uh, he was taking a, a bath in a pound, and uh, it happened, the kids show up, and uh, they saw his butt. They saw more than his butt, of course, which we'll get on to in a minute, but um, yeah. just out of interest, just for any people who might be watching, any exercises you can recommend for firming, toning, lifting, separating? Sure. <laughs> uh, what you should do is to uh, do a lots of running, if not uh, bicycle, if not uh, maybe some uh, ballet or karate. All the good stuff. Yeah. Now, you, you just said that the, the children saw you... Or uh, something else. There's a... <laughs> uh, the children saw you bathing. And right. there's a scene which, you know, it took me by surprise. Uh, the children are sitting and you're there at the breakfast table. Rosanna Arquette, who plays the woman that you get involved with there, they're her children. And they start talking about your physical endowment, mm -hmm. very specifically. And the children say, he's enormous. Yeah. Keep going. And then the mother says, he's average. <laughs> average for a um, basketball team. But... <laughs> No, and I was like, they cut that line when I saw it. And, uh, <laughs> no, it's like, you know, kids, they talk about uh, pennies, like they talk about uh, apple or oranges or uh, banana. It's all whatever. just, to a child, it's just the beauty of nature. Exactly. It's pure. <laughs> now, one of the children in question, of course, it's Macaulay Corkin's brother. Younger brother, I believe? Yes. Uh, no, uh, older. Older brother. Yeah. Now, now, it's a fine performance he hands in, but this is frightening. How many McCorkin kids are there out there? Are we going to have to have a, a long line a of these? A full line. There's a lot of uh, the fight is very busy. <laughs> <laughs> Size of a basketball team, eh? How's <laughs> uh, your wife, by the way? She's very well, thank you. Yeah? She's very well. Maybe we should have a... Uh, next in few days, I'm staying here for like three days in London, have a dinner with, you know, and... And would I be invited, John? Sure. <laughs> This is fine if I'm not, you know, you're in charge, but... Then you'll understand the word average. Yeah. Now you... <laughs> John? John? Yeah. You, you, we know you as a karate, you're kickboxing, but I was amazed when reading about you to find out that you actually studied for many years uh, ballet. Yeah, yeah. I danced for uh, five years, uh, classical ballet, and uh, it really helped me to, <laughs> to stretch <laughs> yes. my legs. Yeah. Could we, last time I interviewed you, you gave me a kickboxing demonstration. I wonder, would you give, would people here benefit from seeing maybe a little bit of ballet from you? Could you do a little bit of a, a pas de da, a changement? I need a partner. Uh, maybe you should be my partner. Oh, gladly. This now, Jean-Claude, we haven't rehearsed any of this, because... Okay. All right. Come on. Come on. What are you going to do with that hand? Yes, You're going to start like this. No, don't move. You're going to start like this. Put your hands like this. Right. And do like a round figure, and I'll be behind you, All waiting right. and holding you. Don't, 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 don't punch me with your elbows. No, no, okay? I'll keep that way down here. Are you ready? What one. do I do? I've got a leg up here. No, the other one. And you turn that direction. This one's up. Okay. One, two. You wouldn't let me do this if I look silly, would you, Sean? No, no. One, <laughs> two, three. Turn. What? That's, that's it. That's it. Oh, that was fantastic. Thank you, John. I think, uh, 
I think uh, I seem to be doing a little more of the demonstrating there than you, Jean. But anyway, listen, now, now uh, I don't know you. I know you, you've come over from L.A., but you probably haven't heard about the big Hoover debacle over here. Do you yourself have a Hoover, a vacuum appliance of any sort? Uh, when I bought my car in Los Angeles, a Hoover was um, in with it. I in mean, with the car? Right. You didn't get any free flights, did you? No. We've got, come over here, I want you to meet someone who's on the phone lines over here. You might have met him already. Uh, he's, we've got a big thing going, people can phone in and swap a hoover for something. I've Roland? I've got the trousers down. Roland, no, Roland. I've got the trousers down, now what? <laughs> Roland. <laughs> I'll ring you back, I'll ring you back. Yes, sir, you take a seat there? Roland, was that a genuine offer? Huh? Jean-Claude Van Damme, Roland, everyone. Was that, what was going on there? Was that a call, someone trying to swap? Nice to meet you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.